Hello everyone, All right, here's another video review, kind of. Hey, it's still Paul Starts. Um, right, today I'm going to play a bit of Nine Ball. Um, as it says this week, um, Nine Ball is available only this week. With an entry fee of 2,500 coins and win 5,000. And if you see at the top right, I have uh, 7,000 coins, so I have enough for a couple of games. Okay, here we go. Selecting my queue, plus uh, upgrade my banana by one level after winning a few um, nine ball pool. So I've got now I've got more aim distance and slightly more spin. Anyway, I still prefer the club queue. Yeah. You get one of the top players, of course. With over nearly a million coins. And he's in the top 10. Wow, and he pots a 9 off the break. Wow. That was so unlucky. Well, let's try another one. Searching for an opponent this time. Look, we get the uh, the practice ball to play with. It's just for warm up. Doesn't mean anything, but it's a bit fun to keep your keep your skills going. So there's no too no uh, long waits between matches. You keep your if you're in a hot run, of potting, you can carry on potting. This feature also um, is available in the Snooker Stars game, which has been out a couple of years. And this is where I found this game from. Now, as you can see, I've got uh, lines up again for this. Right, here we go. We've got a uh, level 10 player. Uh, it's in top 5% and I'm currently in top 1% so I should beat this player. We'll see. Here we go. Oh yeah, top down view uh, this week. That's uh, a bonus feature for those t 2D players out there. I don't actually like it really. I prefer the full 3D view. Playing in 3D, 2D is just no, it doesn't feel right. Got lucky with a snooker. Right, I could line up the, the, the one to the nine, but there's no point because there's not, nothing really on. The, the, the one to the nine is not on for a pot, so I'm just going to play this. A bit of spin to stop it. Nice on the two ball. Okay. I'm nice on a three ball, not bad on the three ball. Um, could have been better, but I didn't use any spin, so I'm just going to play that. A bit of backspin to check it up. So I've got options, as I never remember which which balls are next. But I I'm now feeling so confident I can actually pop pretty much anything on the table. Uh, on this occasion, I'm actually going to use the orange, try and pop the green with a cannon, which worked perfectly. And even better, left the orange over the pocket. Left hand side to stay on that nice angle for the brown. There we are, nice angle to the middle of the pocket. Now, 
Just look around. The black is on the cushion. I'm going to play the stun shot to leave it roughly where it is. There we go. There's the black line up for the pocket, bit of left hand side. To try and keep the nice angle for the nine into the middle pocket, which I kept. There we go. And there we go. That was pretty much a perfect break. <laughs> Poor old Mika. Anyway, next see you next time.